Hi, Pete Jamison from Cox Industries. Here today to talk to you about an exciting project that we've been working on for the last three or four months. It's the new Powerboss engine from Cox. We have decided over a period of the last 12 months to take control of the destiny of our engine manufacturing ourselves. Our engineers have been working quite closely with a number of engineers in China, um, in particular a, bit, a company called Lon Sin, and they have developed up uh, specifically for our Cox and Greenfield units, engines to suit the app different applications. Now Lon Sin supply to Toro, Aarons and even BMW. So we're happy that the quality is going to be certainly sustainable. We're not saying there's anything wrong with the Briggs & Stratton engines, we've been using them for 60 years. However, we decided, as I said before, to control our own destiny and manufacture our own. So to introduce the four models in our lineup, I'm going to get our Quality Assurance Manager, Neil Golding, to run you through them all. Good day everyone, my name's Neil Golding. Uh, I'm just going to introduce to you the new Powerboss range of engines that we're going to be using at Cox Industries moving forwards. Um, there's four in the current range, uh, starting off with a six horsepower overhead valve. It's a 196cc, cast iron sleeve, everything you'd expect from a decent small engine. All of the engines you'll see here today have got dual filtration as standard, uh, so foam, pre-filter and paper elements. Uh, all four stroke, as you'd expect and like I say, it's starting off with a six horsepower which will be going on the chipper range. Okay, and moving on in the range, we then jump up to the 15 horsepower. This of course is gonna be used on the ride-on range. It's a 452cc uh, and it comes with an oil filter and pressurized lubrication, unlike the current 15 and a half Briggs. So it's a step up. Again, cast iron sleeve for longevity. It's an overhead valve, 15 horsepower, single cylinder engine. Okay, moving on from the 15 horsepower, we move up to the 18 horsepower. The 18 is a 546cc engine, again with dual air filtration, full pressure lubrication and everything else you'd expect uh, in a ride-on engine for these machines. Then moving on to the 24 horsepower V-twin. This is the big boy in the range, this is the one that's going to be used on the larger machinery. It's a 708cc V-twin, cast iron sleeve, dual air filtration and full pressure lubrication. 